Hello everyone, and welcome back. Hey, Kara. Hey, Pat. How, How are you doing? doing? I'm good, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm good as well. I'm good as well. Brilliant. So we've just been kind of lounging under the apple tree, waiting for the apples to drop, and yeah. we're, we're, we're getting a good result with that. So um, bigger and better things, I think, is the order of the day. Yeah. Let's so. see if we can make uh, maybe our first bloom. Yes, absolutely. And I think uh, we also, I walked past the dogs because I went to the other apple tree and they seem to be okay. They're just following around a chicken like it's their long lost mama. <laughs> so. Yeah, look at that. They, they seem to be pretty peaceful, so. Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing I killed off the alpha dog. That would be good. So. Okay, I've got a doggy now. And that took me two bones, oh, so I'll, well, I've got one left, so I'll throw that at you. So you're going to throw me your bone? Yeah, I'll throw your bone. <laughs> <laughs> so, yay! Oh, that's cool. Actually, you, um... Nope, no luck. I'm going to gonna feed my one some mutton. Did I just feed him? I threw it on the floor, and he seems to have taken it which is good yeah if you throw food on the floor they are gonna eat it you can even make a, a doggy bowl okay so I can see different statistics when I right click on him I can see his health his um, hunger I can see his owner his loyalty level which is like minus five at the moment I don't know how to get his loyalty level up hmm I would have thought with food, but um <laughs> Yeah, but well seems to be, but I'm guessing he doesn't eat apples. Uh, well, last time I checked uh when they were wild, I threw an apple on the ground and one ate it, so who knows? Okay, so Yep. Yeah, he eats apples. <laughs> My goodness. He's like he's like um He's like our dog in real life. She'll eat absolutely anything. Well, I say he. This is going to be a she, because I think this is going to be Kestra. What are you doing, Kestra? You... Um, I read somewhere that randomly they are going to dig holes, which is filled with random item items. Okay. So uh, that dogs are actually a big benefit in the game now. Okay, and she's sat down, so is she going to follow me? Because I, I keep right-clicking, but all I get is the thing. I don't get anything to make her stand. I believe you can make them sit, uh, but they are going to walk on their own, so it's not like uh, your basic kind of dog. They still have a mind of their own, which okay. is cool. But now she's not following me. I don't know. Well, if she's going to stay there, you know where to find her. Yeah, this is true. And we need to find some more bones so that you can you can get your doggy as well. Oh yeah, that's that's going to happen. I'm going to go and get some more apples and go and feed her. Just Or well, if you want, I have three apples in my inventory. I just got five from the tree. So <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. And so you're chopping down birch trees, ready to build a house, I think. Yeah. And we're just clearing this area here. So I'm just going to show everyone. We're leveling this off so that we've got a nice level place to build a, a fairly good size house. Yeah, Das wouldn't approve if he kept living in a cave. Oh no, she's um. She's gonna come and haunt haunt us. So she'll she'll get up and walk every time I drop food. But um But otherwise she refuses to do anything. Yeah. Do you think she'll eat juice? If I throw that down. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I threw a, a bottle of strawberry juice down and she Oh, sorry Bob. I thought I'd try pressing the left click to see if that would actually make her not sit. Um, shift. No. Sorry, honey lamb. 
Um, so, yeah, I don't know how to not make her sit, but we'll f I might wiki that later. Um, so, more apples. Let's try and get her to the house with apples. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually what my kids do when they want to lure the dog. They they make a trail with with kibble through through the house, so the dogs are gonna follow them. Yeah. Come on, Kestra. Why are you going the opposite direction? Don't be a silly dog. You went and you sat all the way back down where you were. Yeah, I knew I'd got some stairs here somewhere. I'm going to go over to the other apple trees and grab more and more apples. Yeah, just be careful. I I thought there were two packs of dogs running around, so... I think you're right. Um, so I am going to be careful. Because it's the alpha dog that's going to attack you when she spots you on site, so... Yeah. And we all know what happened to me. Yeah. Well, I'm hoping if I get attacked that Kestrel will come find me. But, um, obviously there's some, some element of the controls that I need to understand, because her loyalty is currently minus one now, so it keeps going up. Uh, so the food does work? It seems to be helping. Stamina is showing zero, but it looks like there's a, a way to level up. Loyalty's just gone up without me doing anything, so I don't know if it's just oh. spending time with her as well. Yeah, that could be. So, hmm. So. Really, really interesting how they, um, well, it, implemented that in the game. Hmm. Oh, I think I can give her a name. Really? Yeah. There's a little speech um, bubble next to the uh, interface. Ah, and I, I've just figured out. Um, you, you've also got a book <laughs> on top of it, so you've got idle, follow, stay, guard, and hunt. So if awesome. I if I t put her to follow, she should follow me. Yay! Yay! There she goes, and and the name even shows up when I hover my crosshairs over her. So. So there we go. We're learning stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what what this uh, let's play is all about. Absolutely. So we're going to bring her. I'm going to bring her home. Come on, girl. So you sit there. I'm gonna I just say... need to be really careful that I don't accidentally hit you now. Yeah, because uh, she may leap to my defense. Well, she's she's sitting on my crafting bench now. If she's going to do her business, you're going to clean up. Okay, I'll I'll take that. <laughs> uh, And that's another night gone. Way, you see now she's on stay mode. She's not doesn't even move when I throw the food down. So if I put her on to good. idle, let me look up how much how expensive a dog bowl is. Iron shots. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> we might be waiting a little while for that then. Yeah, we're talking Iron Anvil. Okay. Um, so you stay there, girl, for the time being. I'm harvesting all kind of different crops now. Right, so we wanted a Copper Bloom, so I'm going to start working on the Copper for the Copper Bloom. Okay. Um, so that should help us. And of course, the most important thing is going to be getting purple dye so Kestra can have a purple color. <laughs> so. I'll see what I can arrange for you. Thank you. 
I'm sure we'll figure it out. She's a pretty dog. And of course the difficulty with us skipping the nights is we're not finding the bones to get the to get the other doggy for you. I don't I'm not in a hurry, so Um Okay. So I'm gonna do the try and do the copper bloom if I can remember how to do it and then I think so that's the copper block, two furnaces, cobblestone bricks. So I love the fact that she has her own hung hunger bar and everything. So yeah, I, I never tried to capture one in in one of my single player worlds, but uh, yeah, it <laughs> sounds cool. Yeah, definitely. So, cobblestone. Oh, I've got cobblestone by the bucket load already. So we want cobblestone bricks. Yeah, I tried to look at making barrels, but they are pretty expensive now. Well, that's okay. We can um, figure out what we need to do. Yeah, we need iron to make barrels. So... We need, yeah, we definitely need the bloom to make the bronze, don't we? So we want two furnaces. Yeah. Two furnaces. This is. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay, so we've got cobblestone brick, and we just want a copper block. block of copper. I'm gonna make a bunch of fences so we can start to capture animals as well. Okay, I've got a bloom. Got Yay. a blooming bloom. <laughs> so now we just need tin. Did you get tin as well or did you... Did we not successfully find that just yet? I honestly can't remember. <laughs> It doesn't look like it. Nope. I can go down in the mine to see if I can find some. Okay. Um, and in the meantime, I'm going to make some more tools and go out and flatten some more of that. Uh... Stuff and things. And I think I'll take Kestra with me, she can come for a walk. <laughs> you really are enjoying your dog. Yeah, absolutely. I, en I enjoy all the games that I play. Yeah, I know. That's why I pointed out that you can tame this one as well. And a bonus is that they are they look much cooler than the than the regular wolves, you know? Yeah, because you've got the different furs and let's say I just love the fact that you've got all these hunger bars, all these extra features. I mean, I can send her out hunting. Actually, if I right-click on her now, she's on follow. If I put her on guard, she'll probably guard me, won't she? So she's going to keep an eye out for me. So nothing's yep. going to sneak up. So yeah, so particularly interesting now that I'm just digging holes. Did you... you filled in all the water, didn't you? Yep. I didn't want you to get wet feet. Yeah, well... Or even cold feet. I mean, that would be worse. Oh, that would be even worse. <laughs> so... Excellent. So it means I'm going to pick up a whole bunch of sand here. But yes, I'm. For anyone that hasn't seen the sneak peek that I did on Magic Farm, the reason we're leveling this off is to try and not be going up and down blocks too much. Well, not so much the down, but the up. Because if you go up blocks a lot, <laughs> it makes you hungry. 
I wonder if the same is true for the dogs. Hmm. That's an interesting question. Yeah, I, I, I try to come up with interesting questions every once in a while. It, it, it's, it goes to show people that I'm not just this incredibly massive derp that <laughs> does very, very silly things. I mean, don't get me wrong, I am, but I I'm, know you're not. <laughs> I'm not just that. <laughs> uh, I think you give yourself too too little credit. I I just play and enjoy, and if something goes wrong, you just deal with it, don't you? Yeah. What you up to, girl? What you up to? You're still on guard. Oh, you need some food, don't you? You're down to half hunger bars. Doot, doot, doot. Good girl. Yeah, so you, you're going to get me saying these random things and I'm going to be talking to the dog, not to you. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, every time I say good girl, um, don't be offended. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I'll start saying it when I record with Hitman as well, and then he'll be wondering what the heck's going on. <laughs> uh, probably not. Uh, well, probably, yeah. Because this is not going to be up before you record with him again? Uh, possibly, possibly not. It depends entirely upon how the schedule works out. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's eat some food. In fact, let's also see... Based on your hunger bar, Kestra... If the juice works out better for you like it does for me. Doot. No one some juice. Yep, it looks like um the food does have the same saturation level for the dogs as for the Yep. Which I think that that level of detail in it is pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, but to, to be honest, this it, the entire mind fantasy pack. It's yeah, the amount of time they put in there is pretty awesome. It's 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 such a cool pack. Yeah, it's. I think it's just a shame that they have um, with as Jaded Cat's gone on with Magic Farm. There's been a number of other mods that they've wanted to include that haven't worked with mind fantasy as well. So I think that's a real shame because it is. The, the details of it are very, very good. So obviously yeah. they've they've gone with um, Tinker's Crafting, is it? Tinker's, Tinker's Construct. Construct, that's the one. I knew it was TC, I just... I just couldn't remember which. Um, but, hey, if... Um, if we get there, we get there. But, um, like I say, I'm really enjoying... That's it, Castro. Come and stand on the block that I want to break, you silly girl. Getting dark. Better come home. Yep, yeah, I'm on my way. I found. I managed to find thirteen tin ores. So yay! That means we should be able to get some. Uh, oh, and you've put some different lighting up. Yep. Yeah. I've not seen those before, so they are lanterns. They are pretty cheap to make. It's. Uh, come on, then, girl. It doesn't come through the door either. <laughs> it's it's a torch s surrounded with sticks and a uh, plank. 
Okay, that sounds good. It is. Uh, but before we are gonna fire up this this bloom, we need to make a chimney. Okay. What's I didn't do that before. Is that something I did wrong? Um, no, but it just looks cool. I mean, okay. it wor it works like uh, usually, but like in a regular house, um, you don't want you don't want the smoke filling up the house. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so do you, I need to. Sm I'm going to smelt the, the the. I'm going to smelt some of the tin ore as well, so we've got that ready to do. Otherwise. stuff and things will happen. Jeez. I'm trying to discreetly do this so that someone doesn't notice. Why did you do? I nothing. heard you eating. Nothing. Nothing. I didn't do anything. I didn't eat anything. <laughs> what did your dog eat? Did you oh, give him, I couldn't. Did you give him the steaks? I, I, I honestly don't know. No, I don't think... I haven't found the steaks yet. I just um, threw some cooked mutton out of the chest. Oh, okay. That's okay. I'm not a really big fan of lamb. Well, that's all right then. Oh. Ah, so you can actually craft a proper chimney. Yep. Yeah. Wow. That is cool. And it goes out. It still leaves some smoke inside, but the most most goes out now. Oh, that's cool. So it actually has a function. That's good. So we've got tin and copper. And we're going to need some coal to burn. So you ready for me to fire this up and start making some bronze? Yeah, go ahead. Cool. I think it uses more copper than the furnace normally does. No, it's one with one. Yeah, that's one what it copper. Mean. One copper plus one tin is two bronze. Yeah, but in terms of um, using the coal. Oh yeah, yeah. Right. It does. It doesn't do eight. Um. No. Um, any coal we see, we have to mine out because you're gonna burn through stacks. Yeah. Well, there is some coal down in one of the caves that I did see, so I'll go and grab that in a bit. Oh yeah, the, it's it's no rush. I believe we have two stacks here, so we should be good for now. Yep. So we've got our bloom. So that was one of our Yay. key missions for this um, episode, yeah. I think. Um, well, the next is going to be an anvil. Yes. Um, if you're going to make an anvil, I'm going to set up a tanning rack and see if I can make some leather. Yeah, well, we've got the hound pelts that you picked up and also yeah, I, the I, hide. Yeah, I, I ran in, uh, into a couple of cows. You ran into them at high speed to kill yeah. them, presumably? No, they saw me and they were scared to death. Ah, okay. So... Is that really... Yeah, that stone sword is practically dead. Um, how are you looking for weaponry? Because there's a stone sword in this chest and if you don't need it, I'm going to yoink yeah. it. Take it. I still have a pretty good one, and one that's almost dead. Good. That's cool. I still, I'm, I'm going to have to look up about this loyalty because um, <laughs> I'm also going to have to look up about doggy doggy armor because I want her safe. Um. I see what you mean about the dog bowl. Um, 
hot dog also. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I'm not seeing the... Ah, there we go. Iron hound mail. Bronze hound mail. Wow, that takes a lot of hot bronze. There is even something you can like put in their mouth to make them bite even harder, but I'm not sure what it's called again. Okay. <laughs> you can even make a helmet. A feedback? Wow. Yeah, I'm I'm totally going to be looking oh. up about this. Yeah, you can make like some sort of saddle with a chest on it. Yeah. Really? Yeah, that's so so they can carry stuff. Oh. With, wow, this is awesome. We got to we got to explore this further. This this looks cool. Yeah, well we need to, first of all we I think we need to get some yeah, some more bones so that we can have a doggy for you as well because I think you've already got uh, ideas on what you're going to call your doggy. Yep. Cuz you see we don't we don't uh, just um make stuff up folks. We do actually plan at least a little bit. <laughs> we try we try to but then we get distracted by dogs. Oof. Yeah. I'm just trying to see if the other dog is still over here somewhere. Um, yeah, apparently, still following the chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Mama chicken is a good chicken. So, yeah, so I think we've done pretty well. We're still leveling this off, so... And I've just run out of um, spade again. We I'm gonna have... I'm gonna try to make us an infinite water source close by. Excellent, that's a, a good idea. I'm thinking that I need to kind of try and get a pen together for cows. So I'm hoping there's a lot of fences and gates. Uh, in inside one of the chests. Okay. I kind of went a, a little nuts with making them. That's okay, because I mean, as long as we get a breeding pair, um, yeah, we're, we're pretty much made then. Yeah, and a breeding pair of sheep. That should be awesome as well. <laughs> yeah. So I'll, I'll try and set up a couple of pens somewhere. Hey, girl. Do, 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 do. Yep. Oh, wow, there's only um, two stacks of fences and two gates, so... Yeah, I wonder how that happened. Um, well, if we had a project table, I'd say you had a project table and um, right-clicked, but we don't have a project table because you can't get them in this mod pack. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's it's like I do with all the stuff. I, I don't make a little... I make... A stack. Two stacks. Mm, that's fair. Um, what else am I looking for? I'm looking for... I'm looking for wheat, which will be in the food chest. Because I'm guessing we need... I'm going to need wheat for these cows. Yep. So, do you want to come for a walk? Come on, then. Did you just splash in the water? Yeah, I'm washing off. Uh, I, I was making salt with the paper. Oh, yes, yeah. That makes a nice lot of noise. <laughs> yeah, you should hear it when you're standing in the water. <laughs> yes. Okay, so... I'm going to go over here. I'm getting really slow again. I like the little burping sound <laughs> that your figure makes when you eat something or drink something. Yes. Good, good. I'm guessing you did not make an anvil yet, right? 
I didn't make an anvil yet because I'm just okay. making the enclosures for the animals. Look at that, without looking it up in any eye. I'm only making a small enclosure at the moment. Let's get some cows in here and then get back to... Right, we've got two cows in here. No, we've got one cow in here. Three, three cows in here. Um, and then we will put a gate up. Um, yep, yeah, put a gate up, goodness me. Don't put it... that's it. Okay, so let's feed you two cows. Doot and doot. And now you can kiss, and Kestra, come on. Come on, getting. good girl. And let's go home. Yep, it's getting dark again. Yep. So the cows should be safe there. Oh, I've got a spider on me. Come on, in you come. I'm, I'm guessing your dog made a lunch of the spider. Yes, I believe so. Come on then. <whistles> right. Definitely an advantage to having her around. So, yeah, so it, mo it most definitely is. So, there we go. So, I think we're about ready to to call that it, and we'll be back with the next episode um, yeah. soon. So, until next time, take care, folks. Catch you later, everybody.